What's up, everyone? It is Sunday, so I'm going to open up. Ooh, I'm going to open. Oh, I'm going to bump my desk, apparently. I'm going to open up some football cards today. You're looking down at the last two boxes of 2022 Absolute Football that I will be opening on this channel, or at all, pretty much. Um, I've managed to collect my set of 1 to 100 base cards. I'm still three cards short of the two 101 to 200 rookie cards. Um, I don't even remember the numbers off the top of my head. I have them written down in the other room. And, uh, there, if I looked, I looked it online, they're like three, just random players who I've, I don't think I've ever heard of half of them or all three of them. I don't know. Um, so we're going to open these two hoping that I get them. And if I don't, that'll be the end of it. Uh, I have to figure out what I'm going to do next with the football cards. And I will, I have a couple of ideas in mind and I will talk about that once I'm done opening this. So let's go ahead and get these open. I'm going to start with this box. All right. As I call it the potato chip box because you open a bag of potato chips and it's only about half full. Well, this is kind of the same way. You open it. I'm already missing a bunch of, uh, there's a bunch of real estate there I could be using. And then I open it up and the box is literally, the, the box is half full. Look at all this space over here that they could be using. But yet they're still going to charge you the money they charge you for it. It's a racket. I don't like it. Um, it's going to, it's definitely going to lead into my decision of what I'm going to do next. Um, I do have something in mind. Again, I'll wait till the end to talk about that. Let's go ahead and open our first pack here. All right, we're, we're, we're hoping for those three rookie cards. Um, I really should go get, I'm going to pause this and go get the, the numbers so I know. Hang on one second. All right, I'm back. And as you can see, here's my post-it note. We're looking for 187, 185, and 130. I don't know who they are. I have no idea who they are. I looked up their names and I didn't recognize any of the names. So, all right, here we go. So we're going to, these don't matter. These base cards don't matter anymore. Um, I'm going to run through them and talk about them like I normally do, but again, they don't matter. It doesn't look like I have anything exciting as I fanned out. All right. So we got Jair Alexander. He had a good game this weekend. Josh Allen, big fan. Uh, Derek Henry, Nick Bolton, Carson Wentz, Alvin Kamara had a good game last week. Javante Williams didn't have a good game. So we got our rookie cards. Now we've got Kyler Gordon. What number is he? 181. I don't need that one. We've got Kyle Hamilton. I'm sure I don't need that one. And what I'm thinking that I've learned about this is it seems like they put all the same cards in the same pack. So if I get another one that has um, um, Kyler Gordon, I'm also going to get Kyle Hamilton right underneath it. It's again, it's really disappointing how they do this, how they, they do these cards nowadays. It's again, I'm going to, you know, this channel might as well be like when I was a kid. I might, I might as well call it when I was a kid. This is how it happened because that's kind of what I do with it. So Trent McDuffie. We've got a introductions, George Pickens, and a kid reporter. All right, nothing there. No help there. We need 187, 185, and 130. All right, next pack. All right, we've got Deshaun Watson. Um, I have really negative opinions of him right now. In fact, it, you know, I think I used the word trash as a Browns fan watching him in week one last weekend. Trash. Garbage. Probably the worst trade ever made in the history of any sport ever. Uh, I have very strong feelings. Uh, let's see. Then we've got Deontay Johnson. We've got Tua. Kyler Murray. So this is the all, well, not all quarterbacks, but Aaron Jones. Stephon Diggs. Ryan Tannehill. So a lot of quarterbacks. So we get to our, I, already, I know I have Charleston Rambo. I know I have Carson Strong. I know I have Zamir White. Oh, I got a green Damian Pierce. He's not very good. Let's check these numbers to make sure. 153, 111, 134. All right, that's no help. So no help there. All right, next pack. All right, anything? Oh, we got something maybe right there. I bet it's a green one, whatever it is. So let's see what we got. You got a Patrick Mahomes. See, now when I was a kid, seriously, when I was a kid, pulling a Patrick Mahomes, well, it would have been weird because he was probably not born yet, but assume he was. When I was a kid, pulling a Patrick Mahomes would be like a big deal. You're like, oh my God, I got the best quarterback in football, but this literally means nothing. It's sad. Terry McLaurin. Jameis Winston, oh, I'd love to see him play that Sunday. We don't get, need to get into that. Russell Wilson, I'd love to see him play as a Browns fan. I'd like to see him play for the Steelers on Sunday. 
Uh, then we have Maddie Stafford, Dalvin Cook, Rashad White. I don't think that's what I need. Nope. Brian Cook. Nope. And Drake London. What's, oh, let's see what this is. So we'll get rid of the kid reporter. Let's see what's underneath it here. Oh, last call. Rasul Douglas. And what do we got? We got a green Mike Williams of the Chargers who now plays for the Jets. He had a goose egg on Monday night. And I have him in some fantasy leagues, but luckily I didn't put him on my lineup. Next. We've got Tyreek Hill, uh, DeAndre Hopkins. I love how so many of these players, this is literally two years ago, so many of these players do not play for the same team anymore. It's hilarious. We've got Micah Parsons. He still does, believe me. Uh, AJ Brown, big, big fan. Travis Kelsey. We've got Najee Harris. It looks like I, no, doesn't, I don't think I have anything exciting here. And then we've got Cole Strange. I don't think I need him. 165. You've got George Pickens. 123. You've got Kyle Phillips. 180. Oh, 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 no. 130. Ah. And a stargazing Jonathan Taylor. So that was a terrible pack. That didn't have anything in it. Didn't even have a kid reporter in it, for crying out loud. All right. Three to go. Halfway through this box. All right. Michael Thomas. Wait, let's do this. Let's fan them out. Uh, it looks like there may be something there. I don't know. Devin McCourty. Cooper Cup. You know, Cooper Cup had 14 catches last week. I did not draft a single Ram receiver in any of my fantasy leagues. 15 fantasy league drafts. I did not draft a single Rams receiver, even though in every draft I wanted to. And it, for whatever reason, just never happened. I don't know why. Kirk Cousins. Saquon. Jonathan Grenard. Uh, Josh Jacobs. Then we've got a Trey McBride. We've got a Snoop Connor. A Channing Tindall? Never heard of him. Uh, and I don't need him, so I apparently have him already. Draft Diamonds Rondé Barber. And a Kid Reporter. All right, two to, one to go. Very disappointing so far, but I believe that's what the 2022... Uh, that's like That should be the, the, the subtitle of 2022 Absolute Football. 22 out of 22 Absolute Football. Very disappointing. All right, Dalton Schultz. Wait, let's fan it out. We might have something. We probably got another green card right there. Uh, let's see. Leonard Fournette. Aaron Donald. Mitch Trubisky. Lamar Jackson. Damian Harris. Uh, KV on Thibodeau. Good name. 76. So we've got Danny Gray. 133. Nope. We've got Quay Walker. 190. We've got a green Joe Burrow. I think I already have a green Joe Burrow. And we have a by storm. By the way, Joe Burrow, awful last week. So disappointing. I have been like five fantasy leagues, and he was just awful for me. All right. So let's open up this second box. All right. Open up the potato chip box. Here's your packages. There we go. All right. Let's see if we can. All I really want are these three cards here. I don't care. I mean, obviously you want the good stuff, but I don't really care about the good stuff. I'm not uh, doing this because I want to get the good stuff. All right, come on. Pack open. Jesus. Oh, what do we got? We got a. We got a Nick Chubb. Let's do, let's do the fanning. There's something there. I probably already have it. Uh, we got a DJ Moore. We got a Jalen Waddle, James Conner, Jair Alexander. That's my second Jair, Jair Alexander. Such terrible cards. Josh Allen, I think I already got one of those in the last box. Then we've got a Logan Hall. Could this be it? Yes, this is one of my rookies that I need. Yes. I'm guessing all three of them are. One, oh, no, that one's not. Oh, man, and a Kenny Pickett. One, oh, oh, I got one of them, though. That's exciting. Mitch Trubisky. God, that guy stinks. It's green, but... He stinks. Why? I mean, how do they determine what cards to make green or like what rookie card? These guys are terrible and it, they're getting, putting them in there as if they're worth something or, or maybe they're not. I don't know. I don't understand how this business works anymore. Ugh. I don't even understand how to open a package for crying out loud. All 
I'm gonna have to get scissors. Jesus. All right, we'll make that one last. Holy cow. Probably has my rookies in it that I need. All right, we're down to just 187 and 130. If you have them and you want to give them to me, let me know. Contact me. Leave me a comment. Tua, I already got that one. Okay, this is the same as a pack I already got. Kyler, Aaron Jones, Stephon Diggs, Ryan Tannehill, Mahomes. I mean, I already, literally got all of these in the last box. That's how terrible these cards are. Leo Chanel. Oh, that doesn't sound familiar. Oh, oh, oh. Please be 130. 183. Oh, no. I need 187. Oh, I was so close. Damian Pierce, I just got. Ty Chandler. No thanks. And what is this? Danny Gray. Green Danny Gray. I have no idea who that even is. 197. And I don't need it. So disappointing. All right, let's try this pack again. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Use your strength. There we go. All right. All right. Derrick Henry. Oh, yeah. I already got these cards today, too. This is so terrible. Carson Wentz. Yeah, everybody wants two Carson Wentz's in a day. That's what you want. Kamara. Javante. Oh, I have strong feelings about that idiot. Then we've got a Deontay Johnson. It's silver. That's oh, okay. Yeah, just a base card. Jahan Dotson. Jelani Woods. Tyrion Davis Price. Kenneth Walker Introductions and Kid Reporter. Ugh. Wait, so, I mean, I believe who's the who's the guy that played for the Jets, the running back that now plays for Arizona, Michael something, Michael Carter, Michael Carter. He's number one hundred in the base cards from one to one hundred. I have like nine of those. It's hilarious. All right, Jameis. Again, these are cards I literally just got. Russell Wilson, Stafford. Oh, uh, this is awful. I should get a refund. All right, here we go. Oh, do we? Oh, it looks like we might have something there. All right, rookie cards. Here we go. David Ojabo. Nope. Aiden Hutchinson. Nope. Jermaine Johnson the second. Nope. A green Lamar. A last call. And, and yeah, is does does absolute does Panini think that like hey if we put a green card in there. People won't be disappointed about the box they're opening. All right, Aaron Rodgers. I already got one of those today. Mike, these are all cards I've gotten today. It's hilarious. AJ Brown. Let's fan it out. Doesn't look like anything, anything exciting. I shouldn't even go through these anymore. Cooper Cup. Brian Robinson. I like him. But I don't need him. Chad Muma. I don't know who that is, and I don't need him. Chris Olave. 109 and stargazing miles garrett yeah we don't need to get into talking about the browns and how they played last week last pack one more pack this is the very last pack of absolute football i'm ever going to open needing just two rookie cards number 130 and number 187 if you have them in your collection and you'd like to send them to me for free i'd be okay with that all right devin mccordy kirk cousins saquon again jonathan grenard josh jacobs looks like there might be something in here there's an extra card in there so oh no maybe not maybe not dalton schultz leonard fournette all right what we got we got jaquan brisker 167 travion trayvon walker 125 kyron williams with a giant helmet 182 very close joe montana see now if you would pull a joe montana you'd be happy but in this case i could care less and there you go i am down what was this one this is 185 yep i am literally down to just number 130 and number 187 in the set from 101 to 200, the rookie cards for this set, to having all 200. And uh, I, I guess probably what I'm going to do is the next time I go anywhere that's card related, whether it be a, a show or a shop or anything that starts with an SH, really, um, then I'm going to go ahead and see if they have them. And if they do, I'll just pay them the nickels that it'll take to buy them. And then I'll call it a set. And uh, I have something that I think I'm going to do for the next video. Uh, I think it could be pretty exciting, although I don't know. I'm still researching it. Um, what I like to do is open packs. That's what I like to do more than anything. I, I like to open packs and try to build a set. I'm not in this to try to find kabooms or explosives or downtowns or whatever garbage the, the sports car companies are coming up with now. I really just want to build sets. So I'm either going to do one of two things. I'm going to quit altogether, which probably won't happen. I'm enjoying this. Or I'm going to try to find... Um, 
old packs. Uh, a friend of mine who I went to the national with suggested I find the 1974 set since it's the year I was born. I was looking online a little bit for it and it might be a little bit too costly for me to try to like buy a set. Plus, where am I going to buy packs? You know, they're, they're probably super expensive. I don't know if that's something I want to do, but there was something I found on Etsy that I may look into doing and it's opening packs and it's stuff that's older. We'll see. Um, stay tuned to this channel though, because I'm not, I'm probably not done with football cards. You know, this channel is basically a, when I was younger, this is the kind of, when I was a kid, this is the kind of stuff I did type of channel. And uh, we're going to keep that going. So you'll probably see some more football cards in the future. You're definitely going to see some more APBA dice football and, and some fantasy leagues. And you could say fantasy leagues. You did that when you were a kid. Yeah, I started doing that in 1990. I'm pretty sure I'm the first person who introduced it to this little town I live in. Um, and, uh, and I've been doing it ever since then. So that was it. That was me opening football cards. Thanks for watching everyone and keep an eye out for the next video.